Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am here to share with you um, my recent Dollar Tree haul. There's a couple of hauls I combined in one just to make it easier on myself. I just need to get this stuff put away and get organized because it is, you know, a new year. So let's just jump right in. I picked up this tinsel garland um, for New Year's Eve because they were sold out of all of their New Year's Eve party supplies. And I saw a really cool tutorial where you add this onto like a little stick for like a little, like a pick. So I picked this up for 98 cents. Um, actually it was 50 cents because it was after Christmas. So I grabbed this for 50 cents, which I can still use. I also picked up this really cool star, sequin star pillow, which I thought would be cute to add to a Christmas gift or any gift actually that is celestial. You don't have to just use it for Christmas. You can think outside the box and use it for other things, for a party or gnome stickers. Um, just because they were 50 cents, I would have normally not picked these up. I picked them up primarily for the mushrooms and the candy canes because they're puffy and I think they're cute. I'm not the biggest gnome fan. Um, I'm not totally against them, but I mean, for kids, I think they're cute, but I'm not really into them myself. So... Like I said, I like the mushrooms and the the candy canes and the presents that were puffy um, for 50 cents. So, yeah. Solar lights for Valentine's Day because they are red. I'm going to put them outside my door. And these are also 50 cents each. And then I saw them on other days marked down for four for a dollar. So that would be a quarter each. Um, I don't know. Their pricing is weird. So hopefully these work. I've got to test these out. So... Those are for Valentine's Day. And then I found the Valentine's Day decorations. I found this kissing booth here um, for $1.25. And I did have to go through them to pick out the best one because a lot of them, the little flags or the pennants behind were like the glue goops were like from the glue gun were all like oozing all over the string. So, and some of the hearts were um, like, they looked burnt from, I don't know. Just they had too many imperfections. So this is the best one I could find, which is really adorable for a dollar fifty. Found this really awesome heart muffin tin for a dollar twenty-five. And I'm gonna do a DIY on this hopefully soon. And if I have time to do it, I will share what I do with it. And then I found these adorable little measuring spoons in the shape of a heart. So I had to get them. <laughs> I was like, I didn't even know I was going to see something like this that night. And I just grabbed two of them to gift one for myself and one for somebody else. So I was looking for the Christmas tree or the Valentine's day tree everywhere and I couldn't find it. So I did find these little decorations for a tree. So I picked up the pink. I wasn't a fan of the pale pink ones. I thought they were kind of dingy looking. They just weren't my personal preference of color. I thought the hot pink ones were much more cute. So I picked up two of those, but it's all your own personal preference and that's mine. I eventually did find the tree. I had to go to several stores over the course of three days to find this and then what I did was I called ahead to a store that I didn't check and I didn't want to waste my gas, which, so this is a good idea. So I called ahead and they actually, I asked them if they had it and they said they had some and they asked me how many I needed. And I said, two, they said, yes, we have it. I said, can you hold it for me? And they said, yes. So I didn't have to wonder or guess and run all the way out there, waste my gas money. Cause you know, it's so expensive now. And they saved me two Valentine's Day trees and they were not on the shelf. So if you are looking for them, call ahead and ask them if they have any being held in the back. So like if you look at the tree on the box, you can see that the ornaments look really cute on the tree. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to experiment and see how I like it. And I will decorate it slightly differently from the way they did. So I need to get on that. And that's another reason why I'm making this video. So I picked up two of those trees. That might be everything other than this like roll of silver paper that I also picked up for New Year's Eve to do like to make homemade New Year's Eve decorations. So I already took the tag off. I also bought fake champagne glasses for my kids because they were going over their grandmothers for New Year's Eve because I went out to dinner with the hubby. 
We had a really nice time. It rained a lot that night, unfortunately. So it was a little scary being on the highway, but we did have a really good time. So yeah, I think that is everything from Dollar Tree. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in the next crafty video. Have a great day. Thanks for watching again. Take care.